Today's video is about my time at the DAZN event and how I fought KSI. Make sure you like and subscribe and let's get into it. So forgive me for looking like a mess. It's the day before I'm due to go to Sheffield tomorrow and I am genuinely nervous. I I'm not ready to interview anybody at all. Hopefully it's all gonna go well. As I woke up, I straight away left the house just to get to the train station and catch my train. Started raining, it's typical. For God's sake, man. Woo! The train was here, baby, and we were making our way to Sheffield on time. As I journeyed through the disgusting cesspit that is Manchester and East Midlands, I just could not stop thinking about what questions I was about to ask people at the event. Now that I was in Sheffield, I had to meet my good friend, Drifty. Look how perfect this is. Yeah, man, it's better than your haircut. <laughs> As we arrived to the arena, I was already searching for my prey. Where's KSI? We're ready. We're ready. We're ringside, media, everything. After we ran around the entire stadium and got our media passes, we were finally entering the building and it was insane. The place looked so unreal and I was phased. So we're here ringside. And we're waiting for all the fighters to come. It's going to be an exciting moment, especially when I interview all these lot. And I am ready to troll all of them. Absolutely, it's going to be mental. But for now, it's time to find a seat. And it looks crazy, man. I'll be honest, I've never been somewhere like this. And I'm, I'm shaking. I'm, I'm shaking. However, we had no time to film a mess about because we had to sit down for the first fight. Now, props to both fighters for doing such an amazing job. However, once the winner was chosen, I was already nervous on what we had to do. I just want to know, are you planning on fighting anyone next? Yeah, man, 100%, man. Uh, right now, I'm just going to enjoy this victory, spend time with my family, my friends. Now, I know you think I pussy out, but in reality, Ham was just very busy and I did not want to interrupt him. So I decided it was best if I ended the interview quickly with a little face-off. <laughs> He's too handsome, I can't. He's too handsome. Straight after the interview, we all made our way back to the ring so we could see the second fight because we did not want to miss this. While the second fight was underway, I was questioning on how I would be able to interview the winner slash loser of this fight. And I thought the best way to do that was by making up questions. Question, what do you say to all the people in the crowd that were mistaking you for KSI? For, were mistaking me for KSI? Yeah, like Bro, I can't lie, me and KSI are from the same town, obviously, we're from Oxford. Yeah. So since we were teenagers, like people have always said it, especially if I ever wear a bandana, so. Bro, honestly, I'll say this now, I've been to the gym for the past few weeks. I think I'm in shape to fight. Would you fight me? <laughs> It's not funny. It's not right fun. now, yeah. you beat the shit out of me. So <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you heard it first right here. If anybody steps in the ring with me, they will be absolutely finished. <laughs> Push <it. laughs> As we made our way for the third fight of the night, I was personally excited, among many other things. How do you feel? I can't say. If I say I'll be in trouble, I am very interested in the fight, among other things. Now this fight got wrapped up quicker than a dirty chicken wrap at McDonald's. Come on bro, how you give up that quick man? And I decided instead of asking boxing questions to the fighters, I'd probably try and spit some game. First off, congratulations. Thank you so much. And I just got to ask one thing, can you rate me out of 10? 10. Oh, 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 let's go, let's go. <laughs> now after my incredible loose game I was so hyped that I didn't even focus on the JMX and Ginty fight and completely forgot to interview them. However once Slim came in I knew that I had to interview him. Yeah I'm gonna put my glasses on because kind of uh, you know, the lights getting in my eyes but <laughs> first off bro uh, I got said fantastic fight. Now I remember you and Deji had beef. Is that is that a fight you're gonna ever have? Nah, me and Deji got no beef. We squashed in the last Misfits event. I have mad respect for Deji. He's doing his thing. He's fighting Floyd Mayweather. I might pull up and support, man. You never know, man. I'm Team Deji, yo. Let's go, Deji! I've got not much more to say, bro. I just want to give you congratulations. Have the best night because you deserve it. 100%, bro. All I'm going to ask is, can we get a face-off picture for the camera? I'm sure, sure. Sure, sure. <laughs> <laughs> And now it was time for the final event and while we were all excited, we were hit with a shock. Jay Swingler's fight ended swiftly and he managed to win in just one round. Now unfortunately he didn't show up to the media room, but I gave him a few words. While waiting for the press conference in the media room, my happiness then shifted to pure anxiety. I was in a room with KSI, just a small room with him and a few other people and I was shocked. This is the man I've looked up to for so many years, one of the biggest content creators out there who's made a legacy for himself in YouTube, music, boxing, 
but then I did this. Appreciate it. JJ, you. before you go, can we get a face off, me and you? <laughs> JJ, I'll beg you. Go, do it, do it, do it. Bro, come on. Uh, go for it. <laughs> the anxiety then shifted to pure bewilderment as I was about to stand in front of one of the biggest YouTubers in the UK scene. <laughs> But will I? Will I become KSI's next opponent? <laughs> <laughs> We did it! We did it! We came face to face with KSI at the Misfits Boxing event in Sheffield. Needless to say, my emotions were very, very high at this point. Ready? Go. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that is it. We faced off with KSI. We interviewed all the fighters. We got a 10 out of 10 rating from Astrid. Make sure you stay tuned to this channel because so much more crazy stuff's gonna happen. Thank you all so much for this video and take care. And now I gotta go back home to go for work in the morning. God's sake, man. <laughs>